Hello and welcome back to the channel. So AYN have done it again. They've dropped another Loki 6600 U video. They've started to listen. They're adding more information and that's great to see. So this time they're testing Genshin Impact 1080p medium quality settings and 28 watts. And they've also covered their back by highlighting that it's the CNC engineering machine. And they've turned the LEDs off so that nobody can complain about the fact that the LEDs are visible through the case. So... I'm quite pleased to have released this video, not because they're testing Genshin Impact, we'll get to that in a moment, but because they're actually showing a few more features in the Loki Control Center. So one of the things I speculated in my last video was, this looked like you could change your CPU, your GPU, your TDP, these things on the fly. So let's press play the video. And it looks like I was right. Now it looks like it maybe needs a little bit of fine tuning, but that's working. Now, if they can add in a per game profile, just like on the Steam Deck, that would be fantastic, but this alone is great to see. Now, they've got the fan speed running at 100%, they've turned it to auto, you can muck about with it, it's great. It, it looks like the slider on the bottom isn't what I thought it was, this is for changing the opacity of the, the actual Loki control centre, that's probably quite handy to see. Now they're, they're playing Genshin Impact here and they've fallen into that same silly mistake, I'll just turn the volume down there. That same silly mistake of not targeting 60 FPS. So, great. They were using medium settings at 1080p. Now, I can see that they want to show how good the screen is. So, running at 1080p is fine. But really, they need to try something like FSR or a medium low mix and get a nice, solid, locked 60. Because nobody wants to see gameplay footage when it's going between 34 FPS and 44 FPS. It's just not as smooth as we were expecting. That said, the game itself, this looks pretty good. It's playing pretty well. So, while I'm pleased to see the first part of the video, that was really positive for this, but it's a bit less positive. But, brilliant to see. Anyway, brilliant to see progress has still been made. Thanks for watching this video, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye for now.